22nd to James Marcoux. Now to Wellman, left circle. To Braun, right circle. He shoots. That gets blocked. Down to 13 seconds. And Wellman takes the pass. And Casey Wellman scores. Casey Wellman was camped out on the left side of the crease. He took the pass. He was able to beat Brian Foster. With it now is Hill on the near side. Kicks it out to the top. Ken Ben three. It's good. Kim Ben is on fire right now. UMass back on offense to start the second quarter. And Jonathan Hernandez right up the middle. Bobs and weaves for a touchdown from 16 yards away. So if UMass can make these, they've hit their last three in a row. Two more in the game is tied. Shot is up, and it's good. All three, nothing but net. Now coming out with it this time is just or Julian Talley. And Talley makes a move from right to left, back over the other sideline, and down to the 39-yard line before he's finally pushed out of bounds right there. After about the first minute, they picked up and carried play. Braun got held, we're going to have a penalty, Ortiz will shoot and score! A delayed penalty was being called as Braun got held a little bit. The puck came free, however, to the senior, Will Ortiz, and he nets his third goal of the season. Now Noble gets the ball, going left, and he puts it on the ground, and it's going to be recovered by the Minutemen, and so they get their turnover. Diatima Hill will drive down on the near side, guarded by Alford. She'll kick it in low to Nikki Jones. Nikki Jones with a great turnaround, keeping her pivot foot absolutely schooled. Terry Cashman for two points and a two-point men and women lead. It's a third down, they call it four now. Nelson starts right, big hole up the middle. And it's getting bigger by the moment. He runs over one defender and gets to the five-yard line. And that is his fourth 100-yard game of the season, the 11th of his career, and he's going to cap the drive off with a touchdown run. Here come the Minutemen again. David Bowman shot. He scores! <laughs> 